Hello guys, welcome to Pineapple. So in this video, we are going to introduce. Yeah, I'm going to introduce you to a coding website called Scratch. So Scratch is a wonderful coding website, and I also learn coding on this website. This is a project page of Scratch, and these are some palettes with different blocks. So today I'm going to explain the code section and all the blocks that I'm able to explain. So let's start. The first category is motion, which is represented by a blue color. So here, here the blocks created here are motion like move ahead, like 10 steps, turn 15, go to a random position, glide to a random position, change the X and Y by like a number. So, in this category, the first block which is move 10 steps. So, what this block does is the number is 10. So, it moves this cat here by 10 pixels. So, when I click this block, it moves by 10 pixels. This, the second block here, is a turn 15 degrees to the right. So, when I click, the cat turns 15 degrees. The next block here is turn 15 degrees to the left. So when I click this block, it turns 15 degrees to the left. The next block, the next block here is a go to random position. So when we click this block, the cat goes into a random position anywhere on this stage. The next block is a go to X and Y. So here, these are the X and Y coordinates. This is the X and this is the Y. So when we put certain numbers here, the cat will go to the same position. So here, for, for example, if I put 200x and 3y, so when I click this block, the cat goes to the same x and y position. So the next block, the next block here is a glide one second. So what the, it does is it glides one second to a random position so if i click this block you just glide towards a random position on the stage the next block is the same so we we can like just put random values and it will glide it means it will glide to the same so if i click this x20 and y175 wait so it will glide the cat will glide the to the x and y coordinates here the next the next coordinate is the next block is sorry is point in direction so what this block does is it will point in a certain direction so if i set this direction to 165 the cat will point in this, this direction this is not a change turn this is like a turn degree just turn just turns it around this is point in direction it has a fixed direction the next block here is the change x set x these are the two sets of blocks change x by set x to change y by set y to so what these block does they change and set the certain x values these these block and these block these blocks set change and set certain y values so what this the next block is if on edge bounce so what this block does is if the sprite is on edge it will just bounce and uh, not be stuck on the edge so if I click this here see now the for here first the uh, let me perform it again now it's overlap so if I click this block it will just like pop out uh, this block this is its function so next the next block is set rotation style so what this does it sets it rotation as a three option left right don't rotate it all right now so left right just says like um like how we have a mirror image same don't rotate means the object cannot rotate and all around means it can rotate 360 and these are some variables uh depicting the x position y position and direction of the sprite the next category here is looks so in the looks uh, it is the uh, mainly the physical appearance of the character or means physical looks and what did you say and all those things so this uh, are the think and say blocks so just like so if i click it will just 
I go in a caption it will say hello for the many seconds this says hello like forever and same for you so think there is like a cloud which thinks hmm for two seconds the next is think hmm so it will like think forever till we stop the next is the costumes so in the costumes I change the costumes of the character so I'll explain the what are costumes in the next tutorial so this is I'll just brief you through see there's a costume like we have the frames uh, when a character is running same costumes are the same and this is like next costume if we go want to go it's a backdrop so here is a backdrop now the backdrop is plain now let me just choose like a um, beach backdrop so yeah it's a beach backdrop then the next and uh, now we can just switch backdrop to me and uh, switch backdrop um sorry 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 wait wait I'll get so here switch backdrop to me the next backdrop and here the change size in the next block is change size by 10 so what this does is it change this the size here by a number which is here so if I click this block it will grow because it's changed by 10 and if I click this it will set it to a certain size so now because it's 100% and I click voila it's 100% and this is the change color effect like it changed the color of the crack so if I click this it will change its color by 25 if I set this color effect so it set it to 0 if I click this it comes to normal this is clear the graphics so these are the graphic effects so when you click this block everything is gone deleted and it's all back to normal this is a show and a hide block so if we click this the fact is shown and if we click this the character hides so these are like show and hide blocks these are the layer blocks so when we have many sprites from different layers so we can choose uh, which layer we want to go uh, for example if I go back then it will uh, not go because there is only one sprite so if there are more sprites then it works go forward one layer is like we set a certain number of head to go not like front back like two layers front five layers back again here are the backdrop size and those variables that we need for means the variables as we had in motion so it tells the costume number backdrop number and the size of the uh, uh, of the sprite next categories is of sound so these are mainly all the sound like play sound that sound then start sound support sounds change pitch set pitch means all the sound related and this is clear sound so let's just wipe out all the sound effects so the volume set volume and all and this is one important set of categories event so what this does is uh, when a certain event like uh, when the green flag is clicked or in space screen spread will perform a certain action so for example if i take when space screen is pressed and take a, a move 10 steps so when i press space it moves 10 steps uh, yeah these are all uh, different events like when loudest is greater than 10 then if when I receive messages or, or what happens they broadcast the message the next is another important section control so mainly this is all the control control blocks so like wait a second repeat repeat 10 times repeat forever uh, if then else and if statements like conditions and all and like wait until i think sorry for the background noise because there is a a bullet biker just like i don't know uh, but yeah they are repeat this is a repeat until it repeats certain until certain action stops it so the stop all like a stop all this is when i start as a clone like it duplicates itself and does some events or action this is another important section sensing so what this is is sensing like uh, like how we have in a day-to-day -day life touching a color 
touching mouse pointer and asking what's your name or what happens when a key is pressed and what is the more if means what's the more than loudness time all those sensing categories so this is operators so these are all the mathematical calculations like addition random division which are used in certain games like if you want a certain value then we need to add subtract and so there are some trigonometry functions like abs and all so these are variables so variables are changing values we need for this means for in some games we have the speed score so these are all shown with the help of variables the last section literally like means so we can create a new block which uh, i'll show you in my other means forward tutorials when we make games and all so yeah this was all for this tutorial and this is the first scratch tutorial so it's the introduction bye bye Stay tuned.